Hello students now we will be solving memory based questions of gate 19 for more video solution on gate 19 subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click bell icon for instant notification Hello students I am Sameer and uh, in this video uh, we will be solving uh, the question of control system from uh, time response analysis and the question is why s is the unit step response of the causal system having transfer function gs equals to 3 minus s by s plus 1 into s plus 3 Where y s equals to g s by s, the force response of the system is. There are four options already given in the question. First option is 2 u t, second is u t, and third is u t minus 2 e raised to minus t u t plus e raised to minus 3 t u t, and uh, the fourth one is 2 u t minus 2 e raised to minus t u t plus e raised to minus 3 t u t. So we uh, we are going to solve this question. <coughs> First of all, we have is y s. This y s equals to g s y s, and that is equals to nothing but three minus s by s into s plus one into s plus three. So we can write this transfer function. We can write this output y s in fraction form, in partial fraction form. So I am writing this one as a by s plus b by s plus one plus c by s plus three. If we uh, If we solve this one, we will get this a equals to one, this b equals to minus two, and c equals to one. So our uh, our response y s is y s equals to this one by s minus two by s plus one plus one by s plus three. We have got this response. Now we will have to find the time domain signal. So this time domain signal y t is nothing but u t minus two e to the power minus t u t plus e raised to minus three t u t. But in the question, it is given that the forced response, the forced response of the system is what is forced response? There are two response <coughs> of the any system. First one is transient and second one steady state response. So the transient is nothing but the natural response which goes to zero as time t tends to infinity. But the second one is forced response and that is nothing but the steady state response. So in this equation we have three terms. This both terms e raised to minus t u t and e raised to minus three t u t will go to zero as time t tends to infinity. So our forced response, our forced response of the system y s is nothing but u t only so the option b is correct answer <coughs> hope you like the video and uh, don't forget to like and uh, share the video uh, with your friends thank you very much